All right, guys, here we go. Happy Tuesday. Top 10 worst preservatives. So this is episode number 10 of my series two. It's the final one, guys. So I'm gonna bring, you to, uh, bring to you here is potassium bromate. Potassium bromate is also got the ingredients code 924 with a little a. So 924 with a little a. Uh, it's found in some particular breads, okay? Things like that, so uh, definitely worth, worth a list, uh, worth a check. Uh, guys, if you do like enjoy your breads from time to time, you're best off going to uh, go into a fresh bakery, okay? A well-known one, uh, one that don't use preservatives, okay? Instead of buying the ones um, bought off the shelves that are just loaded with preservatives. Be more vigilant in reading these food labels. Uh, harmful effects from potassium bromate, guys, have found to increase volume in some white flour. Okay, sorry, harmful effects. Use, it's used to increase volume in some white flour bread and rolls. Potassium bromate is known to cause cancer in animals. Okay, so again, um, with the tests that they do through animals, okay, they found that it's definitely not fit for humans. Um, even small amounts in bread can create problems for humans. Now, I just want to conclude episode number 10 here of, of the top 10 worst preservatives. Now, there's still a lot more out there, guys, and understanding all these codes and reading food labels, and the best thing you can do is, uh, Eat more food from the earth, more fruits, more vegetables, more grains, um, consume less meats as well, okay? Ones that are fresher, ones that you know are legit and come from a, um, a legit farmer, things like that, if that's your preference. Now, and, and, and be more vigilant with reading these food labels, guys, because there are so many studies out there. Listen to Zach Bush. If you want a really good podcast, listen to Zach Bush. Um, he's an amazing scientist and doctor. It has a lot of proof and a lot of research from back in the 70s. Things like autism, Alzheimer's, um, Parkinson's, um, fertility, infertility, and, and other behavioral issues are all stemming from the increase of chemicals that they're spraying on food, the preservatives they're putting in food. And the other day, guys, it just feels like I'm a bit of a Bit of a conspiracy, uh, con a bit of a conspiracy type believer to the point where um, I understand that we need to keep the population down, um, but I also don't believe that everyone needs to be bullshit and lied to. Okay, so you've got a choice for you and your family, your children, your children's children, uh, to to make a better decision, to be more, more consciously aware of what you consume. Okay. And, uh, and what, you, what, you, what you feed your family, okay? So learn more about it, all right? Learn more about it. And, uh, and thanks again, guys, for listening. I'm having a ball with my videos. And like I said, just be more consciously aware about what you put in your mouth. Thanks again, guys. That concludes my 10-week Series 2 series on the top 10 worst preservatives and chemicals used in foods. Thanks again, team. Stay lean, eat clean, be mean, Stick to the damn plan. Thanks, guys.